Okay, so this worksheet area is also sometimes known as the big grid. Uh, back in the day, ex before 2007, Excel could only have 65,536 rows and 256 columns. Now it has over a million rows and over 16,000 columns. You can put text, numbers, or formulas in these cells. Each cell will be referenced where the column is represented by a letter, A through Z, and then beyond. Uh, and then the rows are represented by numbers. The cell in the upper left corner of the worksheet is A1, and then it tracks from there. So A1, A2, etc. If I go to the right, it's A1, B1, C1, etc. Um, this is typically common of all spreadsheet programs in terms of how we name things. The active cell is C1 currently. We can see that because it's highlighted here in the top and in the name box, as well as when it's uh, selected, it's all in green, has a green border around it. Note that the active cell doesn't always have to be visible on the screen, but its address is always shown here in the formula bar, like I mentioned a moment ago.